Hello, welcome to the Yarn and Yarns YouTube channel. My name is Angela and all of the places you can find me should be linked in the description box below this video. Welcome today. I'm going to be chatting about some shop talk today. For anyone who is new, I run a small yarn shop here in South Wales in the UK where I live. And every now and then on the channel, I pop up a little video chatting about what's going on in the shop. Um, so if that's not of interest to you, I completely understand. I hope you will join me again um, when I come back in the not too distant future with some more making content. I do try to keep the shop talk to um, their own separate videos just so that folks who aren't interested don't have to kind of plow through that stuff if they don't want to um, and you might notice um, actually on that subject that um, I try to use a specific type of thumbnail for these videos so any shop talk videos um, you should see will have a picture probably of me um, with a sort of bright blue um, background so if you see any videos like that then you know they're the shop uh, related ones so you can either choose to tune in or to skip depending on what you have time for or what your or where your interests lie for anyone who is sticking around then i thank you so much for your company um, i really appreciate your support and your interest in yarn and yarns i've got a few things to chat to you about today so i'm going to try and be as as succinct as possible otherwise this could turn into a fairly long video um, but we'll see how i go <laughs> Um, first off, I want to say thank you so much for the very warm reception that you gave to the Emma Ball products that I la launched in the shop last week. Um, I had so many kind messages and um, quite a few folks who ordered products from that launch. Um, so I really do appreciate that. And I've had some lovely emails from people who've received their items and have been telling me how much they have enjoyed them. So um, it always warms my heart when I get that sort of um, message. Um, I really appreciate people taking the time to let me know that they have received and enjoyed uh, their orders. The thing that sold out the quickest from that update were the project books um, and I again I showed these on the last video so I'm not going to dwell on them only just wanted to say that they're back in stock and I'm hoping to keep them as a regular in stock item um, as long as um, Emma Ball have them in stock. So there's more of those available on the website. Um, because when I place an order with actually with most of my suppliers I have to meet a minimum order um, sort of limit to be able to place an order. In order to get um, the project books back in stock I added a couple of other products to my basket as well. Um, so I just wanted to tell you quickly about those. Um, I've added the sheep in sweaters to the note card sets. Um, so before I had the penguins in pullovers and the woolly puffins um, in these note card sets. I've now got the sheeps in sweaters. Um, so there's 10 note cards in here, five of each of two designs. So for the sheep you get um, this trio here and this one here um, so again those are available over on the website um, and then I also um, ordered a few extra um, sort of, of the single greetings cards to add to the range that I stock these aren't directly related to woolliness but I really love these designs um, and as I say I needed to make my order up so I thought it would be a nice thing to stock a few more of these um, so I have this design which is a lovely um, badger with a little bee against this beautiful golden background with the sunshine and some ferns um, I have this gorgeousness um, which is the murmurations card um, so we have this beautiful murmuration of um, birds and a lovely sunshine and some trees down the bottom there um, and then finally this might be my own personal favorite um, if you followed here for a while you might know that one of my favorite birds over there you can see a little picture is an oyster catcher um, and when I saw that they had this oyster catcher design I couldn't help but pop that one in my basket so I have all of those available over on the website now too Tomorrow is a very exciting day here at Yarn and Yarns because I will be launching the very first ever Charlie Button Yarns Advent Calendar. Um, it's going to be going live on the website at 6pm on Friday the 12th of March. Um, if you have followed here for any length of time or if you have um, visited Charlie's Instagram or her YouTube channel you'll know that Charlie Button Yarns is a um, sort of small produced yarn, um, a beautiful British yarn um, and Charlie collects fleeces from her neighbouring farmers from where she lives in Lancashire and gets them spun up at a small local mill and this year Charlie's going to be offering two options for an advent calendar um, which obviously we'll be sending out later on in the year um, and you might think we're only in March, why are we talking about advent calendars? Um, but this is a very special natural dyed advent calendar and lots of work is going to be going into the preparation of this. Um, so in order to make sure that um, Charlie has A, enough yarn, because as I say, she produces in small batches and B, has enough time to dye up um, all of the mini skeins um, in various natural colours. 
I think it'll be a combination of um, natural yarns and naturally dyed um, mini skeins um, we've decided to launch this now so there'll be a very small quantity um, limited quantity available to start with um, there's two options one will be five gram mini skeins so there'll be 24 five gram mini skeins and the other is 24 10 gram mini skeins um, so yes they'll be launching tomorrow on the website at 6 p.m um, because there is a potential um, because of the limited numbers that these may sell out quite quickly um, depending obviously on the interest um, if you happened to visit the website tomorrow after that launch um, and you find that the slots have all sold out um, and you'd be interested in joining a waiting list please um, contact myself or Charlie um, there is a possibility that there be that there may be more of these available later on in the year depending on um, what sort of quantity of yarn that Charlie gets from this year's clip and also um, the time um, and energy that Charlie has to put these together they're quite a lot of work as I'm sure you can imagine um, so if you're interested if they do sell out and you'd like to be the first to know if more become available um, then we'll be keeping a waiting list obviously you're not committing yourself to anything and there's a possibility that there may not be any more available um depending on what happens later on in the year um, but if you're interested in joining a waiting list if they do sell out um and you'll be the first to know of future availability then yeah just get in touch and we can add you to the list i have two more things to chat to you about um this week and i have not one but two sock clubs to chat to you about yes it might be sock club overload um but one is my mystery sock yarn club and the second is a new club um that i have the opportunity of offering to you and i just couldn't turn the opportunity down so um i hope you will be as excited about these as i am so First off, let's chat about the Mystery Sock Yarn Club. Um, if you've been here for a while, you'll know that for the last few months, I have been offering a Mystery Sock Yarn Box. And um, the idea behind this box is that you will receive a mystery skein of yarn. You will know the fibre content of the yarn because that is listed on the listing over on the website. Um, but you won't know the colour scheme um, or anything else really about it. You don't know uh, the yarn producer um, and it's a, a little bit of a mystery. So to reflect that, I offer, um, I think, 20% off. I can't remember the the rules of my own club <laughs> of the um, normal retail price for this yarn also yarn that does not feature as a regular on the yarn and yarns website so it's not something you could hop onto my website any day of the week and buy so yes the march installment is now available um, over on the website um, this time all of the slots are yarn only i'm afraid i don't have time to offer um, the option of yarn and project bag this month um, i have some project bags to make for the easter boxes that are due to go out any day now and also i want to try and put aside some time to make the woven um, project bags that i was talking about a couple of weeks ago um, project bags are kind of a fun little aside for me and i really have to kind of schedule in putting time aside to make those um, on top of everything else that um, i'm doing <laughs> just in daily life in general and the running of yarn and yarns so um, yes i'm afraid this month there'll be no project bag options i'm always really excited about the yarns that i include in this box um, but this one i am particularly excited about and i'm so so tempted to snag one of these skeins for myself <laughs> which i know this club is really usually popular so i'm probably not going to do that but i might end up ordering one of these um, for myself at a later date um, so i'm not sure if i'm going to be giving too much away here but it's the yarn is not in my usual colour wheelhouse but I actually gasped when I opened the box because this yarn is really pretty um so yeah <laughs> it's so hard for me not to do snag a skein but um the other exciting thing is um and I can't say hand on heart that this is an absolute truth but I have personally not yet seen anyone else here in the UK selling this yarn it's quite a new yarn and um, from a quick google search i can't find anyone here in the uk stocking it um although of course as i say it's a new yarn so that might change in the future but as of the recording date i haven't seen anyone else and of course there are local yarn shops around the country that don't have um easy to find or any website at all so there could be people out there who are stocking it but um as far as i can tell um at the moment it's very hard to get here in the uk so there that's an extra added dimension i think to this month's mystery sock yarn club and as always i think it's worth me pointing out that although we call this the mystery sock yarn club um the yarn is not just for socks it's a four ply yarn um often a 
superwash nylon blend um, which is perfect for making socks um, but it can just as well be used for shawls, hats, scarves, gloves, anything you can knit with 100 grams of four ply yarn you can obviously use this yarn for so that listing is available to purchase over on the website now. Um, there as always unfortunately are limited places available um, and they do have a tendency to sell out quite quickly um, although that may not always be the case but if you are interested in the Mystery Sock Yarn Club um, then I would say hop over to the website sooner rather than later um, to try and snag yourself a place on the March Club. The second sock club and the final thing that I wanted to talk to you about this week um, I couldn't say no to. I know it can be I was thinking is this going to be sock club overload um, but when the supplier reached out to me and asked if I would be interested in um, stocking this six month sock club um, I couldn't I couldn't turn it down. So um, I'm talking about the sock tails club from Manos del Uruguay. Um, if you were able to get in, I think on the December Mystery Sock Yarn Club, um, I featured this yarn in my mystery box. It's the Manos del Uruguay Allegria yarn. And I think of all the sock yarn clubs that I've um, sent out so far, this yarn was probably the one that I got the most feedback on, as in everyone was messaging me to say how much they enjoyed the yarn. And the UK supplier for Manos reached out to me. Um, I couldn't turn this opportunity down. So this sock club differs from my own in that um, you can see entirely up front the yarn and the patterns because each month comes with a skein of yarn and a pattern um, and you can see up front what will be sent out each month. Um, so there's no surprises, um, you can have a look and see if it's something that you think you will be interested in. Um, as I say, the club lasts for six months um, and I've got a few notes. I hope you don't mind because this is not my own club. Um, I wanted to, to try and make sure that I told you um, everything possible um, about this club. Um, so it's a six month exclusive um, subscriber box. Um, each month is named after a cocktail, which is why it's called the Socktails Club. It will be featuring the Allegria yarn. Manos del Uruguay um, are a not-for-profit fair trade organisation um, aiming to provide um, women in rural communities in Uruguay with a means to um, financially support themselves so they can stay in their communities and not have to um, travel outside of their rural areas where they were born and live. Um, so yeah it's a way for people to be able to have a job in their hometown and stay supporting those rural communities. Um, the sock club will feature a variety of different techniques and patterns um, for the socks so I think for anyone who is wanting to branch out and extend their sock knitting skills um, this will probably be a really good one to sign up for and um, there'll be different um, sort of constructions and different um, stitch patterns and with each box you'll get your yarn and a print version of the pattern and um, I believe there will be also some um, links to um, various tutorials for some of the techniques in the patterns um, so I have been led to believe so I hope that is true. Um, so yeah a great way to broaden your sock knitting skills and of course if you take a look at the club and you like the colourway but you don't like the sock pattern that's provided you don't have to um, knit that pattern you can you know just knit a plain pair of vanilla socks if you want to and there's nothing saying that you have to <laughs> knit that particular pattern with that yarn so that's the socks tails club and hopefully um, as I'm chatting I'll try and remember to pop some pictures up on the screen when I'm editing of some of the different um, iterations of the club um, for the six months so the club runs from April to September um, and I have got various different sign up options available to you over on the website now um, and this is where it gets a little bit complicated so if there's anything here that you don't understand um, if you want to get on board with this club but you're finding the listing a little bit bamboozling um, I tried to make it as clear as possible but um, it is quite complicated um, so by all means reach out to me either through the website or yarn and yarns at yahoo.com and I can always invoice you um, just let me know where you are in the world and what option you're interested in. Um, so as I say there's several different payment options and several different um, sort of levels of opt-in options um, so the first one um, you can sign up for the six months of the club and um, if you're able to pay that in advance um, I can offer you because the supplier is offering me a 15% discount um, that means that each month your box will cost around about 
£18.60 I think it is. Um, um, I have for that particular payment option on the website I have also added six months worth of postage costs um, onto the price that you pay. This is editing Angela just quickly popping in. Um, I am setting up or I have now set up the um, club options on the website. I hadn't actually done that when I recorded the video. I'm having problems um, getting the website to reflect that, um, like a free postage option for the six month and the two month instalments. Um, so when, if you decide to go for those, when you check out, um, it's actually including uh, like a letter postage um, as the shipping cost and I can't figure out a way to remove that um, so um, please forgive me for that um, if you wouldn't mind um, just checking out and paying that cost um, for the UK it's a couple of pounds and I will actually refund that um, postage cost to you I know it's a bit of a faff um, but it's a bit tricky figuring out how to calculate this club and include all the postages and stuff like that um, so I think that's probably the best way to do it um, or the other option is you get in touch with me and I'll send you um, an invoice um, which should hopefully reflect um, free postage <sighs> yeah <laughs> technology and me I'm just not clever enough to figure out these things I don't think so yeah um, please bear with me for that if you um, go to the um, sort of full payment option and it's still trying to um, charge you postage if you could either um, just pay that and I'll refund you or um, contact me and I'll send you a separate invoice thank you um, so I hope that makes sense um, and there will, there will be options for the full payment um, and there'll be an option for UK for Europe for the USA and for anywhere else in the world so um, if you are able to sign up for that option then please do make sure you're selecting the right option um, from the drop down menu pertaining to where you are in the world when you order this club um, if you sign up for the full six months um, there will also be a bonus seventh pattern in this collection um, and the seventh pattern is designed as a bit of a scrappy sock um, so basically the design incorporates the leftovers from the six months of the yarn club so um, I thought that was a really fun idea to include um, an extra pattern um, I don't have details or pictures for that extra pattern um, but I believe it's there for anyone who signs up for the six month club from the get-go um, so yes that club as I say you if you're able to sign up and pay the full amount you'll get 15% off um, I want to try and make this as accessible for everyone as possible. I know that um, signing up for a six month club um, is not going to be affordable for everyone. Um, so I've got a second discount option and this will be offered at 10% off um, and you pay 50% of the sock club up front now. Um, and then I will invoice you at the end of next month. So at the end of April, I'll invoice you for the second three months of the club. You can sign up for that and there'll be options for um, different parts of the world if you're not living in the UK. The third option is you can sign up for the six months but you pay monthly so there's no discount um, at this level um, of subscription but you will if you follow through and you pay all of the invoices that I send you on a monthly basis you will get that seventh extra pattern um, it's just that I will invoice you on a monthly basis and I think that will work out at around £22 per box plus the postage um, so yes that option is available too so you can pay all of it up front you can pay 50% up front um, you can pay month by month and then the final option um, if you know there are um, months of the club that you are interested in um, but you don't want to go for the full six months then you can just sign up um, I'll have an option where you can just sign up for the April club only um, and then once those pre-orders are finished um, I can have I'll have a sign up for the May Club and etc etc as the months go on um, so you can choose to dip in and out um, of the club um, if there are certain months that you're interested in if you're interested in the yarn and pattern combination for a particular month um, you could choose to um, order one or up to five or even six if you really want to um, but you if you do it that way you won't get the extra pattern that somewhat makes sense it's a little bit tricky to explain um, but it's just a lovely six month sock club um, with various sign up options um, so as I said at the start if there's any confusion if there's anything you're not clear on then please do drop me a line and I'll be happy to invoice you for the options that you want or try to explain things a little bit further pre-orders for 
the sign up for the full six months are going to be live on the website for the next probably week to 10 days. Um, I'll probably close it at the end of next week, I think, um, to give me time to place my order and have it shipped to me um, in time for the beginning of next next month and then after that the discount options will fall off because you won't be able to order a, the sort of six month version of that club oh yeah <laughs> i don't know if that made sense i hope it did <laughs> beautiful yarn beautiful patterns lovely sock yarn club is the basis summary synopsis <laughs> So I think that's everything um, for me to chat to you about this week. I hope you are as enthusiastic and excited about the launch of these three new products, the Advent, the Mystery Sock Club and the Socktail Sock Club as I am. And yes, just once again, thank you to anyone who watches these videos, who orders any of the products that I have on Yarn and Yarn's website. Um, your support just really does mean the world to me. Just so lovely to be able to have you here as part of the yarn and yarns community sharing this yarn journey with me i shall be back again soon i'm sure um, with some more videos so i hope you will join me for those but until we get to spend time together again i hope you get to do some of the things that you enjoy great big willy hugs to you all bye for now <laughs>